I play the husband of the woman who owned the horse. And in this movie, I'm kind of the one who's a little bit old fashioned, has a kind of 1950s view of families where I think she should be at home, raising the kids, cooking my dinner, and taking care of the house. And so uh, what's interesting is to watch her kind of go against that and, and follow this dream. I think a lot of the context for the movie, which is important, is the, that uh, it was Vietnam and Watergate. And the country was just in this kind of, this funk about, this had been brought down for years with these things. And then along came this horse. And it, it really becomes this symbol for the country to kind of rally around. And so important that it is an animal, a beautiful creature that can just has this amazing ability to run fast. It seems so simple, and yet that's, that's what, apparently, I was 10 years old, but uh, apparently that's what the country needed. And, and uh, it, is, it really is amazing that the Secretary was on the cover of all these magazines, and you, you've, just from that alone, you can tell that, that's, that the country was starving for something like that, that they could rally around, that had no ambiguity.